by the lawyer and I'm here specifically to see one of our boys that uh, is at the college here which is the uh, art and cultural college called Tasuba. and so I uh, was just having a few words with him there's a lot of noise going on at the exhibition so we're not able to uh, stay there the wind is blowing very hard here today so tell us Alex how many years have you been in Latin Africa? From what age did you come? Six years. So he came when he was a six-year-old little boy. And why was that, Alan? Why did you come into care? So Alex lost both of his parents and he was brought to us as a six-year-old. Now, 13 years later, he's at this college because he's a very gifted artist. This is some of the works he's done. Such bright and colourful work. This young man just has such ability from his brains to his hands. He can create so many different things. Some of the gifts he's given me over the years has absolutely astounded me. And so, I've come here today uh, this is where we're going to start the journey from Bagamoya to Ujiji, but I couldn't go until I came to see Alex, to see how he was getting on, and to see some of the work that he has just done. For us to send Alex to this college, he's got one more year to do, it would cost about a thousand dollars a year, and I think that is money well spent to give a child the opportunity to share his gifts like this. So, what would you like to do when you finish your course, Alex? You'd like to work with Light in Africa? Well, Light in Africa, I think, will have to uh, get its lavender and uh, its butterfly farm completed and get the license for it. And then Alex can finish, have his own display selling to the tourists. How does that sound? Good? Okay. Right. Thank you very much, Alex. We'll have to break in. God bless you. Thank you. See you at Christmas. Okay. Take care of yourself. Love you. Bye.